Hey, what's up, surveyors? All right, so I'm out here working, middle of North Dakota. I gotta do a little video video review on this new Trimble radio. It's pretty sweet. So I'm so used to using the uh, Trimmark 2E that this is be just unbelievable. So first off, the uh, new radio here comes in like this nice fabric case, which is kind of nice, you know, for storing everything all up. Usually I'd probably have like a base box or something, but it's got some zippers here. Open it up here. All right, so first thing we have here is the uh, disc for mounting it to a tripod. We also have this side bracket, which is kind of nice if you want to like mount it to the side of the tripod. If you only have one tripod, you can use your uh, base on there as well. So it kind of fits in like that. I'll put it all back together here a little bit. Then we have our data cable. One powers, one goes to the radio. The other one goes to your receiver. Powers both units. Spectacular. Then this is the new uh, TDL 450H. It's pretty nice. Let me just yank it out of here quick. All right, so the new radio has actually just got one little antenna port and uh, one little data port and power port. Big difference compared to the uh, to the other stuff. Big heat sink on the back. Tell you what, this thing doesn't get warm at all. So put it back in there. And then some other little cables, you know, miscellaneous stuff. And then it has all these little rods. Um, you can actually get up about two, two of these. I don't know if I can get it all in there. So there it is. Two, two of these, and then put the antenna on top. And then uh, I was kind of disappointed in this. It doesn't have a whip antenna. But, uh, you know, it fits all right, I guess. I've got, I went uh, five miles, no problem. Middle North Dakota here, so. But that's about it, really. Um, I like that it, it uh, it's a smaller form factor. I like that it has this, this screen on here. So you can, uh, you can use these buttons here to adjust the frequency, the output. Um, you can also adjust, like, if it's a repeater or if it's a base radio. I mean, you can do a lot of stuff from this. You can even do the protocol, which we set it to Trimark 3 for our base broadcast protocol. That worked pretty good. So, overall, this thing is a, a really clean radio, I think, compared to some of the other ones where they accepted a lot of other interference, and then this one just keeps on going, no problem. So, running the uh, R6. There it is. That's my rover. And then uh, I guess we got the uh, R8 out there. That was our base receiver. Oh yeah, our new toy. Maybe I'll do a little review on that sometime too. <laughs> but anyway, this is only on the, uh, the TDL 450H. Uh, spectacular radio. I don't know, you know the price. I would imagine it's probably comparable to some of the other stuff they have. You know, four or five thousand dollars, but uh, that's it. Enjoy. Give me comments. Leave them below. Thank you.